All right, I'm gonna do a bike check. I just finished building this bike not that long ago. It's a mix of a low rider and a chopper. Uh, I got the bike from a friend. It was black and red, but it looks so different than when I got it. I powder coated the frame red, powder coated the white stuff white. Uh, I'll just do some close ups of some stuff here. So the spokes, these are like little plastic straws that you can buy. Oh. It's got a like a chopper kids bike front end on it. I've got boat speakers. I just took them and I will, I drilled sideways through the forks to get the the two bolts on. Normally they clamp on a round surface, but I was able to put bolts in them. I've got a quad lock up here for my for my phone to lock my phone onto it. It's a speaker bike, so I've got a sound system in it. It's just leftover stuff that I had from back in the day. An old Sony Explode 12 inch with a, it's got like a port right here in the box. It's a Q-Logic box, 12 inch. Uh, see my, my license plate wiggles. It's a, got an LED whip. Uh, I've got a flag on the other side also that says surrender the booty. Uh, so right here on the box, I've got an like a master arming switch for everything. And then I have a house receptacle right here to turn on my LED whip. I don't know if you can see that. It's pretty bright in the sunshine. And then uh, the, the one below it does the... Uh, I've got a LED light on the front and I have a like a LED light on the rear it flashes um, a brick saddle I bought that new just for comfort um, I welded up my own subframe for it it was that was pretty complicated um, to make that subframe to support the weight of the box properly. I left the wiring out here exposed because I wanted a little character on the bike. I could have hidden all the wiring. Like, from the headstock, I hid all the wiring inside of the, inside of the tube and brought it down the frame and popped it out down below. But I wanted a little character so people could see some wires. Right here, next to the master disconnect, I have a a charger for a charging port for my uh, just trickle charger. Uh, I used a cheap differential off of uh, eBay for like 60 bucks. It made it super hard to build because over by the wheels, they were really flexible and uh, it wouldn't support the weight, so the wheels were bending all over the place. So I had to add some supports into my into my uh, subframe that I built and to support the box I did an aluminum aluminum like 90 degree that was a heck of a lot lighter than steel I'll show you um, a video of the uh, of the um, the guts of the box at some point too. There's my cup holder. So here it is as a whole. Hope you like it.